he was going to kill Banquo. I could feel it. Even though he apparently thought it was best not to tell me what his plans were. Even though we had been in this together, and without me, we wouldn't be where we were. He felt it was better if he made his next steps on his own. I tried telling him that he had to let go of Duncan, because what's done is done. And then he had to put Banquo out of his mind because his life and the life of his son were not eternal. They would one day die at nature's hands. But he wouldn't listen to me. I couldn't believe he was fully cutting me out. He was gonna kill another human being and he wasn't even gonna tell me. What had I done that made him see me as less? Why did he just decide to cut me out? It was unbelievably painful and frustrating. Not only because he wasn't letting me in, but because he was going to kill another innocent for no reason other than his paranoia. I used to be able to talk him out of these mind traps. I used to be able to reach him. Now all I saw was a man in pain who thought that killing more people was the only way to heal. He thought that if he killed all the people who were in some way a threat to him, that he would become invincible because he had lost the logic that he would just eventually kill everyone around him, possibly even me.